I think this is soda, you guys. Oh, but what, what, what flavor soda? We're gonna find out in three, two, one. What could it possibly be? <gasps> hey, sugar stars, welcome back to my channel. ABC, if you're ready to see me open this entire box of Miniverse Make It Mini Food Cafe Series 2. This is a brand new series, you guys, with all new foods from our favorite series ever, the Cafe Series. And the last series one, they had boba, but this time they have other stuff like macaroons, they have popcorn, they got, what is that, nachos? But first, I have to juggle these. One, where's Coco Melon? Who's excited? Are you excited? You're gonna watch me juggle. You will sit, you can sit up here, right there. One, two, three balls. Here I go. Coco Melon, wish me luck. So here we are at my desk and right now we're in a new location because my house is currently under construction and it will be ready for a house tour very very soon so if you're excited for that say in the comments yay house tour here we have the whole box of miniverse make it mini series two now i'm not gonna make every single miniverse right now in this video because the video would be way too long but we're gonna pick a lucky five first five from this box to make for this video and as always any dupes or extra ingredients I will be putting in this here magic fridge and look you guys I got new shopping cards I got my melody shopping cart I got a cinema roll shopping cart oh my gosh look at this it's pink and blue tiny wheels as well I got a Karomi shopping cart and I got a Hello Kitty herself shopping cart I actually got all of these from Miniso the Hello Kitty was the last one I got one of every single Sanrio character that I saw there so I feel super we're lucky so extra good ingredients will be going in those carts and then into the magic fridge and this magic fridge you guys it's getting full like look at look at all that and then i found out i can put some stuff in here into the into the freezer down below but this is getting full so just in case i got are you ready for this are you guys ready i got one not just one fridge this is from five below i also got another fridge so two extra fridges just in case the magic fridge becomes full i will be opening these as well ah, and then filling them with miniverse ingredients okay who's ready who's ready who's ready who's ready abc if you're ready so let's let's get let's let's get into it i i will be making all these eventually i'll probably be doing several miniverse cafe parts there is exactly how many did i get i think i got 17 there are 17 miniverses in here but we are going to do five today so this is number one let's do this one number two Number three, number four, and let's get this guy that just dropped down. Number five. Oh my gosh! Ah! So here are the mini verses that we're going to do today. Make sure to tap the like button to give us good luck for no duplicates. If I do get duplicates, I will try to make a brand new miniverse out of the duplicates so we can still have fun with that. Now let us choose which miniverse is going to be the first. Oh wait, no, I have to unwrap all of them first. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, boom. And here they are all unwrapped. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to open these. Let's pick which Miniverse, we are going to open first. Here we go. Eeny, meeny, miny, moe. Catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother said to pick the very best one, and it is you, this one. Oh, with the pretty pink wrapper inside. I'm shaking in excitement. So this is the first Miniverse. Let's see what we're gonna get. Ah, what food are we making? I love Cafe Series because Cafe Series has all like the best desserts. Oh my gosh. Wait, what is this? Oh, look at that. It's like a, a cake platter thing okay and we got some new juices Ooh, whoa whoa hold up let's take a little sneaky peeky oh and there's still some that's coming soon okay let's see what we can we can get macarons do you how do you guys say it macaroons or macarons i've been pronouncing it macarons because that's just how it's spelled macarons okay and then we got the the cakes here the chocolate dipped strawberries all right enough of that we're gonna cross them off as we as we open the mini verses but we have to unwrap all the bags we have one two three four bags to unwrap first bag this feels like a box it says made fresh and i'm glad you guys liked the miniverse lifestyle that we did the other the last video the miniverse lifestyle i was a little bit scared because it wasn't food related but it still did really well three two one <gasps> what is this oh they're jello 
churros. Oh my gosh, they're chocolate dipped churros. This is so cute. This guy's wearing sunglasses. He's so cool. What's this? This has like utensils on it. Second bag. Oh, they put the tweezers in a separate bag. Oh, wait, and then we got a spoon. Spoon, hello. You're gonna go right there. Third bag. The bags are different for this miniverse. They're more of like a papery matte feel, not really shiny, plasticky like the last cafe series. This says thank you, three, two, one. What's this? <gasps> A little plate for our churros. And then last bag. This one says, keep it cool. Three, two, one. Opening the, what is this? Oh, churro chocolate sauce. Whoa, it has a little sun on it. So this will be the resin that will be going all over the churros. And we have all the ingredients laid out. And I actually also got this little cup. I didn't notice it, but I found it just now. It's so cute. We are making this right now. It is the choco churros. And the cup. Oh, you put the churro in the cup. Wait, does it float like that? No, it shouldn't, right? What? Let's see what the instructions say. So we dip the churro into the resin directly. You dip it in the chocolate sauce. We put each dipped churro on the plate. We use the spoon to put the chocolate into the cup. Seems simple enough. So let's start by opening a chocolate sauce. Oh, I opened it. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. It's bubbly. I gotta pop the bubble with the spoon. Pop, 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 pop. Whoa, that was pretty cool. So I'm gonna put my spoon right there for safekeeping. I'll take my churros. Ah, oh, it's just open here. Oh, I love the package design of this box. It's adorable. That's why I love Miniverse so much because they put in so much care and detail into every single thing. <gasps> Do you guys see these churros? They actually have like sugar little bits on them. Oh my gosh, these look real. Guys, don't eat these. I know you guys want me to eat them, but you're not supposed to eat them. Wow, my little churros, they're so cute. Let's dip one at a time and then we, we use my, my oven. But if you don't have a UV lamp, you can always go outside in the sun and they will bake in the sun as well. All right, time to dip the churros. Beep. Oh, oh, that's amazing. And then I will put it on the plate like, like that. And then we're gonna go in for our second churro. Boop. I'm gonna give this one a spin. Let's dunk it like a lot, like halfway. This is making me hungry. Stop it. Let's put this one. I'm gonna be like creative. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this, lay it like that, and then we have one more churro. Oop. And then I'll place it. Is that weird? It's kind of hanging off. Yeah, that, that's weird. Like, like that. <gasps> oh my gosh. Time to put the chocolate into the cup. So this is like a little serving, a little sauce cup. I think that's what the idea is. My spoon is so small. I cannot put a lot of chocolate. Oh. <laughs> I actually want it to be full, so let's do more. Ooh, yes. Oh my gosh, this looks so perfect. So this is an advanced technique. We want to glue it onto the plate like that. So I'm putting a little, a little drop there and then sticking the cup on top. And now it is baking time. How did they make it float? Okay, I want it to float. Should I try to get it to float? Maybe I'll get it to float. Let's let's try to do that. I'm gonna take my tweezers. I'm going to do this. We're gonna do this really fast. I have no idea what is gonna happen, but it's gonna be really interesting. Oh gosh. I'm like baking it in midair. Is this working? Okay, one more bake, one more bake. Okay, okay, okay. If this, if I can- <gasps> I can't believe my eyes. I just made magic. Do you see this? It's floating. I did not even know this was possible, but here's the finished product. <laughs> Dude, this is so cool. Y'all, I'm so proud of that. Okay, next miniverse. First, we must cross off choco churros from our list. And then we will move on. The only extra ingredient I have currently is, well, I like this box. This is such a cute box. So I'm gonna put this box in it and then I'll put the, the chocolate sauce. 
boop into the my melody car goodbye my melody we have four more mini verses to go Eeny meeny miny mo, catch a tiger by the toe if he hollers let him go my mother said to pick the very best one and it is you this is lucky mini verse number two let's open it up three two one Paper, 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 paper. So many papers, so many papers. Ooh, what is this? <gasps> oh my gosh, did we get a soda? Let's see the first bag. Keep cool, three, two, one. And we got... <gasps> it is a grape soda! Next bag, we have... A little tiny bag of ice. It's so cute. Okay, we are definitely making a drink. Now let's see what color straw we're gonna get. Okay, this also contains the tweezers. So we got tweezers, tweezer, and three, two, one. It is a orange straw. Wow, I love that. Purple and orange, they're gonna look so good together. And then lastly, we need a cup. Where is our cup? Ah, in here. This one says thank you as well. And it is a, oh, I think there's a lid too. Oh, wow. Wow, I'm excited. I'm so excited to see the color of this purple drink. Purple drink. Instructions. We are making this grape soda. Very simple, very nice. Not like the last one we did. The last one we did was very advanced. We gotta put the drink in, gotta put the ice in, the lid. I can't forget the straw. I always forget the straw before baking. I don't know why. Okay, let's do it. We have to open the soda first. So let's unzip the soda. Boop. Ooh, that was satisfying. This is adorable. It even has like the feet. You know how soda bottles have feet? I don't know. I don't know what to call them. So I call them feet. Let's see what color. <gasps> wow. That is such a beautiful purple color. Ooh, that's so pretty. So if I get another soda dupe, I'm gonna like mix soda flavors together. That would be super cool. Now let's get a couple of cubes of ice. Come here. There's the ice. Okay, so now we're gonna just plop this in. It's a little bit sticky. Sorry. Oh! Ooh. It's sinking. How much ice do you guys like in your soda? I'm a girly who only puts in a little bit of ice because I want to have more liquid in my drink versus ice. Some drinks, man, they put so much ice to the point that half the drink is ice and not the actual drink. Can you see the ice through it? Oh yeah, you, you kind of can. I put too much soda. It is overflowing. Last thing to do is to put the cap. <gasps> oh my gosh, do you see? The ice is like shining through like that. Okay, let's bake. And it is done. Grape soda. Check. And here is the finished product. The straw's a bit long. I'm gonna give it a little snip. Snip. There we go. There we go. Now it looks like a little bit more proportion, like an actual drink. So cute. Let's put it in the back with our flying churro. Hello Kitty cart, hello Kitty cart. Let us put the grape soda into the Hello Kitty cart. We're also going to put some ice into the Hello Kitty cart. And that is all for the extra ingredients for this one to put into the magic fridge for later. Let's pick our third lucky mini verse that we're going to make next. Eeny meeny miny mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother said to pick the very best one and it is you, sir. Let's open up this third mini verse capsule. Three, two, one. Whoa. Oh, we got so many bags in this one. What? These have the same wrapping. I'm confused, but there are indeed five bags. Let's open the first bag, which is, this is the tweezers. So let's open up this one first, since I know it's in it. What else? Is that it? Yep, okay. Let's open up the next bag. Let's do this guy. Wonder what's in this one. What is this? What is this? What is this supposed to contain? It looks like a... You put the food in here, definitely, but I, I have no idea yet. Looks kind of like a wiener dog. Oh, wait, there's one more thing in here. Three, two, one. What is this? It looks like a balloon. Does this go like... <gasps> It's his head. It's a little tiny. It looks like a balloon dog. You know how balloons have that little, little, little end there. Let's open this one. Three, two, one. I see a cap and also 
a it's a little jar of mustard and he has a little, a little hat on that's super cute this is a big jar of mustard do we really need all that mustard we have two more bags so let's get this one first opened and we have dun dun dun, dun hot dogs <laughs> Tiny hot dogs. I guess you would you could sell hot dogs at a cafe, right? It says snacky snacks in the corner here as well. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to open these. And then we have to have bread, right? B. Oh my! The hot dog buns. Oh, so cute! I did not expect to be making like a savory treat today. This is what we're making. Hot dog with mustard. And it goes in this cute little doggy. Wait, but we have so many hot dogs. This one's really simple. So we got the bun, hot dog, mustard on top, and we bakey bake. And that's it. Let's open up the bag of buns. But then we are gonna have an extra hot dog. What do we do with the extra hot dog? I, I guess it can go in the magic fridge. Come here, bun. Come here, bun. Whoa. Hello, bun. <gasps> Do you see that bread texture? Oh my gosh. You can actually like kind of open it up. It's a pretty, it's pretty, it's not squishy, but it's, it's malleable. So it goes in there like <laughs> Let's put a hot dog in. Opening this one up like that. Don't we have to cook a hot? Oh, we're, we're gonna cook it in the oven, I guess. Wow. I'm holding a hot dog. Oh, they're very flexible. <laughs> Put the bun. <laughs> okay, first, I actually wanna, I wanna do this. Oh, that was very nice. It fits very snugly into the hot dog bun. We gotta put mustard on top. We got so much mustard, we gotta use it. Opening it up. Oh! There it is already. Let's put our little cap. Squeeze out a nice little wavy line of mustard. Squeezing the mustard. Ooh, oh, come on, get out. Does that look appetizing? I think I, I put a little bit too much mustard. <laughs> I actually don't even eat mustard. Let's bake. Boop. Baking the hot dog. Look at him all cute in there. I think he needs a name. All hot dogs should be served on a plate like that. Do, 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 boo. Here's a hot dog. Let's cross it off complete. And here is what I made. <laughs> I don't know if I like how the mustard came out. I think when it came out, too much came out. So that's why it's all like, but that's okay. Cause we have a lot of extra ingredients to put inside the cart. Let's bring in the cinnamon roll cart. Hi cinnamon roll. I love this cart. It is the cutest thing ever. Here, we got some hot dogs put in the cart. We got some mustard put in the cart. And we also got one single hot dog bun. Boop. And we're gonna put that in the magic fridge for later. This is so cute. I love this. I just love the, the plates. I guess the hot dog's pretty cute too. <laughs> Ooh, the hot dog and the soda is gonna go really good together. We have... Two more Miniverse Cafe Series 2 capsules left to do. Let's see which one we're doing next. <gasps> Eeny, meeny, miny, moe, catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother said to pick the very best one, and it is you. Second to last Miniverse capsule, but don't worry, guys. We are definitely going to do all of the Miniverse capsules in the box that I got, so watch out. Make sure you subscribe so you guys find out when exactly I post the next episodes for Miniverse Cafe Series 2. Here we go. Ooh. We have four bags in this capsule for today. Let's open the first one. Ooh, oh, <gasps> I think this is soda, you guys. Oh, but what, what, what flavor soda? We're gonna find out in three, two, one. What could it possibly be? <gasps> it's orange. You guys, we got the orange one. Orange soda, yay. I think those are the only two sodas so far. Oh no, there's a slushy. Oh, we have to get the slushy. Oh my gosh, we have to get every single one. There is the cup, cup and lid. This must be the ice. 
<gasps> yes, it is the tiny bag of ice. And then lastly, we have what color straw though? <gasps> it is an orange straw, orange straw for an orange drink. And then the tweezers, kind of similar to the grape. We put the juice in, the, 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 we put the soda in, the ice, the lid, and then the straw. Let's go, opening up the cup, opening up the soda. Ooh, I love opening up the soda. I like that little click it does. All right, here we go. Let's see what color. Of course it could be orange, but I want to see like how it shines, you know? Ooh, ooh, whoa, it's like a lighter orange than I imagined. Oh, this is so pretty. Okay, I don't want to fill it up too much because I want to, I want to save room for ice. The last one, I kind of overfilled it. Okay, let's put some ice in here. Clink, clink, oh, ah, 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 oh, oh, I spilled everything. Okay, let's push it down. Boop, 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 you guys don't have to do this, but I'm just like a perfectionist, you know? Come on, cut. Er, there we go. I speed ran this universe. Let's bake. Into the oven. She is done. Crossing off the orange soda. Boop. And then here is the finished product. I really like how this turned out. No messes, no spills. Just a very nice looking orange soda. And then I got this orange soda here. You know, I haven't- where's my placemat? Oh, there it is. Do the other things have placemats? Or have I just been throwing them away? This is the placemat for the orange soda, so it'll go on top just like that. Okay, let's put it in the back with the purple soda. Let's bring out the Karomi cart. I've been using a different cart for every mini verse. How funny. Okay, so we have the extra ingredient of orange soda here. Boop! And then the extra ingredient of some ice. Let's see our carts. <laughs> so this is cinnamon roll cart, the hot dog ingredients. This is Karomi cart, my melody cart, <laughs> and then the Hello Kitty cart. What's in the Hello Kitty cart? Oh, the grape stuff. Oh my gosh, I can't. I, w I wish I had one more cart for the last mini verse, but I'm gonna have to pick a random cart because there's only one more left. Actually, no, there's a, there's 12 more, but future videos, you guys. Here we go, what's it gonna be? Three, two, one. We have one, two, papers, three, four. What is this? Yo, we got a wrapper. It says Snacky Snacks Co. Okay, I better save that. Save that for later, because we don't know, we don't know what that is yet. Let's open up the first bag, which contains the tweezers. What else is in here though? Oh, I see a spoon, I see a spoon, I see a spoon. Hello, spoon. Burp, burp, burp. So we know it's something that you eat with a spoon. What is in this bag? Three, two, one, what could this be? Oh, you guys, is this a dupe? No way, we got a churro dupe. Okay, what are we gonna do? Hold on, I need to think. Wait, what is this then? All right, all right, all right. Churro dupe. Oh my gosh, we got a dupe. I got an idea. So we have churros, but y'all, we also have a hot dog bun. And in this magic fridge, we got, are these strawberries? I don't think this could fit in a hot dog bun. I think I want to put sprinkles. Where's my sprinkles? Wait, I see it. Okay, I, I found the sprinkles. Okay, I'm going to use sprinkles. Ooh, whipped cream. Wait, I have whipped cream. Maybe I'll put some whipped cream on top. <laughs> I'm gonna make a churro hot dog. Thank you, Magic Fridge. So first of all, we gotta get the bun. I get to use my extra bun, yay! That's exciting. I hope the churro will fit inside. Oh, I'm gonna make it fit. Let's get these churros out. Oh my gosh, stop. Oh, <gasps> it fits perfectly in the bun. No. Would this actually be good in real life? I wonder. So we have to use some chocolate sauce to stick the sprinkles on top. So let's do that. Um, I don't like the wrapper though. Maybe it can go under? Yeah, I don't like it on the plate. Like, I'm trying to make this look elegant. It needs to look like you could serve it at a fancy restaurant. Here we go. <gasps> One, two, three. Boop. 
Oh, I love doing that. Let's get some um, chocolate sauce and just putting it on our Archero hot dog. Very, very casually like. That's, I think that's good. Can the whipped cream fit on top? is the question whoa 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 what am i making hold on hold on i think we need more chocolate sauce we want to we want the whipped cream to stay on that is the goal ah Ooh, and i kind of like how it the chocolate drips off i don't want to put that on the other side too that Ooh. okay something's happening here i'm making i'm inventing a dessert right now now let's put the the, the, the whipped cream on top like so. I only have two. I should have three. You know, this is fine. This looks good. Whoa, that looks good. I want to put chocolate sauce on the plate. You know, like a like a chef. Fancy chefs, they do like, they do the drizzle. Wow, drizzle like that on the plate. That's how you know it's fancy. There's, there's my drizzle. Okay, now let's put place. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Now sprinkles. I think the sprinkles are gonna give it that color that it needs. Slightly tap. <gasps> come on, come on. Yes, yes, yes. Beautiful, beautiful. This is my masterpiece. The color, the composition, the drizzle on the plate. Mmm, I had a third whipped cream, but I, I like it with two. I like it with two. It's good. It's good with two. Okay, y'all, it's done. We got a dupe of the churros, so I made my own product. So let me present to you the Ta -ding! churro hot dog. As you can see, there are elements of churro and hot dog placed in a bun. It's a dessert. It's a new dessert that I, I, I invented with whipped cream on top. There are sprinkles. I think we made something really good here. I'm gonna I'm a get the cinnamon roll carts. Oh no, I ran over! <sighs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I, I almost ran over my churro hot dog. We have churros, extra churros. We have the extra sprinkles that I have to put back in the fridge. And we also have a cup. So I could use this cup for, for a future recipe if I wanted to. Let us put all the extra ingredients into the magic fridge. And if I run out of room, I will be opening an extra fridge for the extra ingredients. Wow. I'm gonna have to get an extra fridge to contain all the fridges, maybe. Should I have it sing, you guys? Oh no, but if I have it sing, I'm gonna have to wait for it to stop singing. Okay, what the heck? <laughs> The song goes on for so long. You done? Oh, they're done. Okay. And then I have all my shopping carts loaded up right here. First cart. Let's get it out of the way. Cinnamon roll. What you got? You got some churros. Oh, gosh. Um, <laughs> let's put the churros maybe right, right up here. Okay. It's yep, yep, yep. That stays right there. We got some chocolate sauce. Let's put chocolate sauce right there there we have sprinkles sprinkles was in the back over here so i'm gonna oh goodness sprinkles can go <gasps> don't fall and then milk we have hot dogs oh where do i put the hot dogs i think it can fit right there oh that's a good spot and then what's this so much mustard why did they give us so much mustard we don't need all that mustard we really don't oh a cup cup can go right there that's a good spot for cup yep all right, Simro, you're done. I got whipped cream. Where do I put this one whipped cream? We can put it right there. Next is Hello Kitty. What do we got in Hello Kitty's cart? We have a grape soda. We can put the grape soda. Ooh, this is a tight fit, you guys. Oh no, something spilled in here. Oh no, I have to wipe this up immediately. Oh gosh. You know, this box of cereal is actually empty, so I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to toss you because you are empty. You were taking up space in my fridge, so goodbye. Thank you so much. Whew, I think I figured it out. Is there anything more? Okay, we got ice. I put the ice up here usually. Good. Okay, Hello Kitty, you're done. Nice. Next is Karomi. What do you got in here, Karomi? Got some orange soda. So we can put the orange soda Ooh, in the freezer. So much room in the freezer. And then we also have ice. There's so many bags of ice now. Oh my gosh, this fridge is loaded. Chromie, you are finished. Goodbye, Chromie. And lastly is my Melody. We only have, okay, chocolate churro sauce. 
chocolate churro sauce is gonna fit in here. But also, y'all, the freezer is getting kind of full here. Hmm, can we make it? And then we have... Wait, this box is empty as well. Okay, we don't need an empty box of churros sitting in the fridge. Gotta save some space, but that is all for the magic fridge. We were able to fit everything inside. Amazing. Oh. Oh, okay, I closed. So probably I'll be opening these fridges for next video. So I can't wait to open this, especially this one. It's a Hello Kitty fridge specifically, and it has a microwave. Do you guys see that? This is straight from Japan. So I'm really excited to open this, but we shall save it for later. So these are all the foods that we've made today, including the little inventive creation that I made at the very end. Comment below which Miniverse Cafe Series 2 food that we made today was your favorite my personal favorite was the churro the floating churro i can't believe this actually worked comment below if you're excited for more cafe series 2 miniverse videos and i'll see you in my next one bye